This week an image went viral of what some are saying is a winged demon on the streets of Phoenix. In this video we take a look at winged cryptids and ask if this viral image is a sign of the apocalypse. Welcome to IF, we post videos on the strange and mysterious. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to get notifications each and every time a new video is posted. This image has been viewed over 100,000 times as of making this video and looks like it will probably be seen 100,000 more. First appearing on a Facebook post by an Arizonan resident, the picture shows what some think is a huge winged demon. Many say that on closer inspection a man can even be seen kneeling at the feet of the beast. According to the witness, once this picture was snapped the beast just walked away. Many have claimed that this sighting is a sign that the end of times are upon us. Others that it is nothing more than a hoax. But winged humanoid figures have played a huge part in human history. Stories of angels and demons have both entities sporting huge wings. The angels have wings with a bird-like appearance whereas demons have wings similar to those of a bat. There are however other cryptids that could match the description of this image. The first that springs to mind would be the Mothman or should I say Mothmen as sightings of these creatures span the globe. Said to be a large grey creature with glowing red eyes and a 10 foot wingspan, the most famous sighting took place in Point Pleasant in 1966. This appearance is said to be connected to a devastating bridge collapse that occurred after the creature had been reported in the area. Mothmen are not only found in the US, some of the earliest reports can be traced back to the UK where a creature matching the Mothman was seen on multiple occasions over the years. In the UK it is known as Owlman. In 1976 witnesses reported seeing the cryptid. They said it was like a big owl with pointed ears, as big as a man. The eyes were red and glowing. At first I thought it was someone dressed up playing a joke trying to scare us. I laughed at it, we both did. Then it went up in the air and we both screamed. When it went up you could see its feet, they were like pincers. Could this picture be of a mothman or something else? There are winged humans across all cultures. Could this be a picture of something from outside of European folklore? How about an Mananangao? This beast is more commonly referred to as a tic tic. Originating in the Philippines, this creature is a winged humanoid but with some unique abilities. It can detach its upper body from its lower body and in the daylight takes the form of a beautiful woman. When night falls, it retreats to a hiding spot and begins its ritual and transforms into a hideous vampire like hunter. It grows a pair of enormous bat like wings, very sharp teeth and a dreadfully long sharp tongue. In the process it produces this very tiny shrieking sound repeatedly. Then it separates from its lower body and flies into the air to begin hunting for its prey, leaving its legs and bottom half of its torso on the ground. So maybe this monster is not the answer, it will most likely leave a body count in its wake. Maybe it's something from Middle Eastern culture. Jin, Jan or Jin are supernatural creatures of Islamic mythology but are also found in pre-Islamic Arabian mythology. They are often mentioned in the Quran and other Islamic texts and reside in an unseen world, another universe beyond our known universe. The Quran says that the jinn are made of smokeless and scorching fire but are also physical in nature being able to interact in a tactile manner with people and objects and likewise be acted upon. The Quran tells tell of how Allah created many different types of jinn. These jinn have the ability to take on different forms such as dogs and snakes. Some are said to have wings. Islamic teachings say the jinn are of three types, a type that has wings and they fly through the air, a type that looks like a snake and dogs and a type that stops for a rest 
then resumes its journey. Could this image be that of a jinn? Maybe it's something else. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you think that this beast is a sign of an apocalypse, make sure you share this video as a warning. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like and maybe subscribe. Follow us on social media by searching We Are If. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.